Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. How are we all this evening? So, we are back for another live stream. We're having a look again at Dyson Sphere. Um, I was supposed to play this on Sunday, I just wasn't feeling great, but I thought I don't want to welch on, um, on my promised schedule. So, it's a couple of days late, but uh, it's here nonetheless. Um, I'm pretty sure that I've got the, um, the the chat function working properly today as well. Um, we will see very soon if that's the case. <laughs> um, in fact, I can test that very quickly now before we get into it. Um, so last time uh, we did a couple of things. We got ourselves set up with kind of some very, very, very basic resources. We got blue, um, blue research cubes up and going, although very, very slow, so we're going to be fixing that almost immediately in today's session. Um, and, uh, yeah, and then um, th there's a couple of different things that's, that's on the agenda today. I want to get up to the pile of notes to kind of trawl through as we're going along. Um, first thing is going to be uh, to fix the power problem. Um, I noticed just at the end that uh, the lights were flickering on and off uh, quite uh, erratically, so, yeah. Power first, then um, power for our suit, then make more blue cubes, and then we'll start to think about uh, red cubes as well, which will involve oil. So let's have a look. Well, oh, yes, that is worth it. Right, let's get it going then. So as I said, the um, first priority is to sort out power. You can kind of see... The lights on all the buildings are flickering on and off. So if we have a better look at this situation, let's just get it the right way round. Right way. That way. Cool. Um, so yeah, click on the power pylons. It'll tell you um, how much you're generating and how much you're using. So 11, 12, 13, sometimes up to 15. So yeah, we just need to uh, solve that power, uh, power situation immediately before we can do anything else. So um let's find ourselves a nice big source of coal um but we can probably probably do a little bit here the only problem is the water so in fact let's go and grab ourselves um some of the uh floor pile things um i believe i'd set up oh no i've not automated them um okay so yeah steel production like a, a more significant steel production is also on the agenda today as well. Um, I mean, to be fair, that is a fair, fair chunk of steel. Um, so, yeah, we got kind of steel production going, but we didn't get the flooring. Yeah, we'll be uh, we'll be fixing that. Um, Yeah, that's that. Um, oops, wrong button. Power two. You can hold down the middle mouse button to drag. Rotate the angle of view and hold down the right mouse button. Drag to where the angle of view is. Press M three to point to the front to the left button. Mm -hmm, right. What is it that I want? I want to build resources. So that is F. Um, right. Let's try and produce as many of these tiles as we can. We need a lot anyway. Um, uh, we will focus on building a little um, flooring uh, automation soon, but power is the one we need to fix. Um, so we're going to need a lot more of these thermal power plants. So let's get them building too. Um, there they are. We need more stone. Oh dear. Get away from the stone. Make a quick journey back. Um. Certainly sounds like a good start. Um, let's pick up a few cogs so we're not having to craft those in our build menu. I mean, there'll be some over here, but I don't think we've actually set up any automation of the cogs. But no, we've got 
scale from the line really is too much. Hmm. Okay. It is what it is. Let's uh, get those two back on. Uh, so while that's going, let's get this flooring down so that we can uh, actually build power and kind of pave over all of this water. Let's have a look. No decoration. soil. Oh well. We've um we've made a little bit of space there at least. Um so let's get some miners down. Power. Let's see. None of them have been crafted yet. Um, waiting for a few more cogs and then they will start to uh, start rolling in. So yeah, just to kind of talk through what the plan is for this session. So uh, as I said, to begin with, we need to sort out power. Um, these three miners alone are not going to be enough. Um, we will have to uh, find some soil in a moment or two. Um, but this lot can go... Ah, should have built it one tile up. Actually, I suppose that will work. Um, uh, mess around with that. Uh, so we need some sorters. That works. We now need some conveyors. One down. Many, many, many more. Oh, this is... Let's um, build the conveyors first. Don't want treading on our toes. And move things around. Uh, you might be able to see that my suit power is dying fast. It's all about first moment. Fix so that conveyor. Just destroy that. going to be out of power any second, so let's just whack down our power pylons and stand in the middle of them. It's just rushing right back up there. Um, sorters, so two into the second one. How is it doing? There we go. Um, ah, we got a little too close. Damn. Um, Brush that one and five. There. Cool. Let's see. Uh, 
right. I suppose I can pop it there. Plus or minus, we're going to have to build some more of those in a second. Um, Okay, that's a little bit better. Uh, we've put down 12 more generators. Let's see what that's done to our total capacity generation. 40.9 now, um, and it was only getting up to 15. I will definitely be putting a lot more of those in throughout the session, but that will tide us over for the next part of the build. So the next part of the build is getting more blue science cubes going. Um, so, where is the original blue cube? Oh, it's here. Um, this is a very small, very inefficient setup. Oh, manual research can't get going. Um, let's just fix that quick, so we'll need to get some trees. And some coal and some graphite as well. Okay, trees. Um, coal. We'll just go and rob some from the uh, generators over. Well, mine is feeding me. Anyway. Um, Got that, and then we just need the graphite, and I don't believe that I've actually set up any graphite production. I'm not sure that I can build it in the suit either. Oh, I can. Great. Uh, coal. Grab a bit more. Graphite. How much does it provide for one to one? Like it's one to one. Let's grab a little bit more coal out of the gen out of the uh, miner. Just ten more. And whatever's left over, we can just throw into the suit. Um, okay, blue science. Uh, so yes, we've got a very, very small, very inefficient blue science setup here, so we are going to be uh, trying to mass produce it. Um, and again, all we're going to need is iron and copper to do that. Um, so let's find ourselves a reasonable chunk of each resource. We've got iron here. Uh, do we have any local copper deposits? Not particularly. Oh, in fact, no. I was going to use the copper that's um, feeding the mall. So it's, it's producing more than enough um, for, for, for this. Let's, uh, let's use that's a very small iron that's uh but we've got the oil in the way here let's see is there any iron down instead that one over there but again we've got a load of water in the way um Okay, I suppose we can just feed the copper over. Um, so let's do a little bit of a change over here. Uh, we are going to want all of it coming round this way instead.
We are just out of power. Oh, damn it. Have it keep running that way. Let's throw down our pylons. Drones won't even come out because I've got no power. <laughs> uh dear. Um, do we have any over? No, like it. Oh, actually, what we do have is those and those. Device. Sweet. Uh, right. Let's expand this uh, offer production. Can't quite fit on. Let's see if we can get maybe just one. Oh, there we go. That's all we needed. Um, and then we will feed this lot across the water. Um, okay, let's hook all of this up. Using the um, pointy brackets or the uh, left right arrows, um, we can just copy and paste these things across. Lacking power, so let's just throw that down. Um, okay, we have our copper coming in, so now for our iron, but we are out of miners. Uh, can only build three, but uh, I mean, that's we're going to need to start with anyway. Let me have a look at my notes. Nope, certainly not three. We're going to need a lot more than three. <laughs> so, uh, well, actually, no. No, just two should do it. Sweet as. Um, so, there. There. Where are we going to build? Again, we've got to really, what we need to do is just uh, pave this over. Because uh, it's going to be a pain otherwise. So the way that we can increase our soil pile uh, is when, generally when we just like put down buildings. That's one way. Um, another way is uh, you can see there as I'm placing or I'm kind of hovering over squares, it will tell you how much soil you will get or need um, based on uh, where you're placing it. So I'm just going to increase the size of the pile and see where we can get most. Let's go for that one there. There. This will, of course, use up the um, the the floor tiles, so we're going to have to go and produce some more. But I don't see a way around this, unfortunately. Um, just one of them things. Uh, we need floor tiles to pave over the sea, but we also need soil. That one. Too large an area. Um, so 32k soil, that should put a dent in it, um, but we do of course need to go and collect some resources. Hi Blah, uh, good to see you again, thanks for joining us. Let's 
sorry, that was a little while ago, even despite the fact that the uh, chat thing is working and it is up on my screen now. Yay! Still didn't notice. <laughs> got, got far too carried away with what I was up to. Um, so we do need a few of these, so let's just take half a stack and that's that for a long time. We fine for conveyors. We are fine for sorters, we're fine for assemblers. Cool. Oh, uh, we do need to collect some of these, not loads. Uh, so what we do need, again, we'll need some steel. Oh, it's actually uh, need a lot of steel there. Good. Oh, we've... Uh, Still got a fair, fair amount in the in It's just stone. Unfortunately, not producing a lot of stone for us right now. But we've only got one on the on the job, so I might that the uh, the flooring does require quite a lot of stone. Steel box because we have a lot. Can't promise that this is going to be enough to um, completely cover that uh, that water, but good. Be a good start. Overshot my mark. I wanted to go and charge them. Standing over here. Right. Um, so number nine, F one. Uh, as small as we can. to use the uh, the blocks as sparingly as possible and we're out of soil again um, so we're gonna have to again use some of the flooring so that we can pick up some soil and we left the item <laughs> ah. Two steps forward, step back. Um, well, in fact, that does kind of give us a bit of room to start building. Um, I think what we're going to do, so there's two oil. This is one there, one there. Have a bit of oil up here. We do need it to be somewhat accessible, though. So, in fact, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. Uh, ah. So that we redirect the copper this way. Right, I'll just do it that far for now until we've got more of the floor down. Um, See what we can do with what we have. Eleven k now. You know, I think that's probably going to be enough. So what we'll do? Um, let me have a look at the setup. I've got. Uh, up down here so 
three ingots. Oh, they're just going straight into the assemblers. Um, so, therefore, that's, you know what, I'm also going to place the miners in the Five of processes on one side, I can four processes. So, say if we did it in this one. That's good enough. Um. Mm -hmm. Right, like this. Almost out of power, so let's just quickly run over to the pylons. Power reach stop. Processes. Power. Hey, sweet. Uh, so we want the rings on. Oh, actually, should have done with having the rings on that side. Rethink that. Let's um, remove that from there and we'll place it side. Okay, so we want um, rings on this side, so we'll just copy that and we want ingots on this side. Uh, copy them across. Okay. Um, so we need two assemblers for the rings. Um, Let's slightly misplace that a little bit further down. Those going that way and down across and up through there. Some five minutes. I want it. There we go. Uh, so let's these outputs. And here we're going to be making Oh, let's go that's all powered. Oh, it is. Great. Um, and then. To make my mistake. And that I wrote it down the way. 
screwed it all up. Hmm. Actually, it's, it's not the end of the world. Um, a minor fix can solve this. Rather than a complete overhaul. Ugh, it's still not ideal. It's going to be a bit of a spaghetti junction, this one. are in fact going to need a little bit more soil so we can that up uh, let's see most not a lot around here Um, that will do. Get more search on the go in a second. The data shows this is a planet without natural silicone dating. However, you can still obtain some by smelting stone. While you still need a massive silicone collection, you need to find a planet rich with silicone-based astenic compounds. What? Well, we'll try it with the cough the first time. Fill up with a bit of power in a second. Rings feeding back in. That. Oh, I'll just up there. Down the next one. Ah. Um, recharge again. You know, I should really just fill the suit up with uh, some coal so I don't have to keep walking over. Or at least, you know, it'll give me a bit of uh, passive production of power. that in. Is this, uh, hi Roy, uh, sorry, I, again, despite the fact that the comments are now actually working, I've uh, not been paying attention. So is this indie? Yes, it, it, it's relatively indie. Um, it's still in early access. Um, it's been updated all the time, but there's been an update just today. Um, and good evening, by the way. Uh, yes, blah, always spaghetti. Uh, <laughs> I always have some nice laid out plans for how these are going to look good, but uh, then reality sets in or you make a mistake and you're just uh, having to work with what you got. Um, so, yeah, Spaghetti Junction incoming. <laughs> uh, this is going to look absolute mess. Uh, let's move that power up. You need it. We will bring the ingots over here, stop, and 
we'll put in a bridge. So just using the um, up and down arrow keys on a uh, keyboard, uh, you can raise or lower conveyors. Can be a little bit fiddly sometimes. You know what that's not too bad it could be a lot 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 worse um but still it is a bit of a jumbled spaghetti hey so we have uh circuits being built here And now we can actually finally get the uh, blue research going. So just need a couple of uh, materials picked up first. Steal all the uh, oops. Steal all of the uh, iron pieces from smelters. We need a ton of how many do we? Initially, we'll need uh, eight. So, yeah, we can build 18 with what we've got on us. That kind of um, <laughs> missing a couple of sources, so let's pick up some circuits and some rings. Circuits on up properly. Let's pick that quickly. Okay, that's that building. That would have been it. Uh, okay, so. We need uh, these output. Probably. circuit out here on over on and one two three one two three and two three let's just spin that down so I can see uh, okay, let's hook all of this up. Let me just double check something. I'll... Uh, it's a one-to-one -one ratio, so yeah, one. Um, one sort of each is fine. Output to there. Rings. Power. Effect. Oops. Last piece of the puzzle. Um, just need to be thoughtful about where I place them. I think in a row along the fine. So let's place those first, just so we've got.
Great. Um. Sorters coming out. So I think it be fair. Nearly there. How we're going. To the search. Your production process has reached a certain point. Now, if the statistics you have gathered are all that great, I think it's time to move on. It improves the output of tests for each group, and I think it's time for us to decide. Use these dynamic results to help you analyze your production process. So, um, as you'll see, I've not actually got anything researching at the moment, which is fine. Um, uh, sorry, is it always isometric? Uh, I mean, you can, you know, you can scale it round, but uh, obviously this view here is much less useful than uh, being able to uh, be able to see uh, everything that you uh, you're looking at. Um, right, let's, before I move on to, th there's a couple of like little niggly things that need to get done, um, before we start the next major project, which is oil. Um, so automating steel, or at least having a better steel factory than the one that we've got right now, um, then we will also need to think about making, um, the flooring automated so I don't have to stop in starting. Um, so in fact, because that's all kind of filled up now, and that is starting to, uh, to fill up. Hmm. The production of these rings is quite slow not really saturating the line. Like, you can see that the circuits are doing fine. Um, but the, the ring's not so much. Very Just have a quick look at two rings to one copper. But, I mean, we've got five rings dedicated. Uh, that might be a problem. That's not powered up. We are producing plenty of the rings anyway, so that's not a big issue. Again, the copper's pretty full. Um, what is the construction time for one of these rings compared to a circuit? It's 45 a minute, those, and 45 a minute of those. So I, d I don't quite understand why the circuits are backing up and the rings are struggling. So I'll tell you what I'm going to do just to kind of um, fill the system up. I will manually place some rings into the research. That will give it a chance to kind of um, catch up. 200 rings. Um, let's do this as well. Who was a better way? Well, 
uh, which will be to move. Actually, do you know it didn't move at all? Get rid of the sorters. Um, what we'll do is like that with box in the middle. Sorter. Sorter here coming in. Sorter there going out. Sorter there going. This means that uh, this is constantly producing. Have a sort of going back onto this line just in case as well, but place the box in an awkward way, so just ignore it now. Um, what did I come over here to do? I came over here to get the. I picked up 200, be enough to saturate the. Uh, Technology stuff over here. Um, let's have a look. what I probably put them into all the wrong ones I should have filled the ones at the start first Is it backing up at all no not really I'm gonna need a lot more of them to be able to do it I'll have to come back to it later 